Today's reader forum letter comes to us from Dan Mountjoy of Oregon City, Oregon. Dan writes, Dear Jeff, last weekend we had a campfire discussion about balancing trailer tires. Some people are in favor of balancing and some say don't bother. What's the real story? Well, Dan, that's a pretty easy question to answer. Yes, you should balance your trailer tires and for all the really good reasons why you keep the tires on your tow vehicle or family car balanced. However, just because there's no one in the trailer to feel it doesn't mean that an out of balance tire back here isn't affecting the trailer. What it's doing, in fact, the whole time that it's spinning, it's shaking and vibrating and essentially trying to tear things apart. The number one side effect is extra wear and tear on the tread. An out of balance tire will wear tread unevenly or possibly cause tread separations and general you know, tire failures. But all that bouncing and vibrating also has a bad effect on the wheel bearings, the spindles, the suspension components, uh, the, the mounting pivots for the, uh, for the leaf spring, the mount up front, the, uh, the, the shackle and back. All those components can wear out more quickly due to an out of balance tire. Plus, that vibration, of course, is translated up into the vehicle, and that can cause things like uh, cabinets, shelves, woodwork, everything else inside can start coming apart too. So we're gonna go ahead and take these tires down to our local Les Schwab dealership here in Eugene, Oregon, give them a spin and uh, see how they come out. This tire is gonna take three and one quarter ounces. The second tire required two and a, two and a half ounces. Well, I'd say those results pretty much speak for themselves. Two and a half ounces of weight on one tire, three and a half ounces on the other. Pretty good reason to keep your trailer tires balanced. It's a smart thing to do. We'd like to thank our friends at George M. Sutton Service Center for help with this project. Well, I hope that answered your question, Dan. And remember, you can send your letters in to the Reader Forum page on our RollinOnTV.com website. If we use your letter on the air, we'll mail you a stylish Rollin' On TV t-shirt.